Hello, my name is Evan Walda, and today I'm going to be doing a devotional about friendship. Um, I just want to start things off with a Bible verse I found from Colossians chapter 3, verse 13. Um, it says, Bear with each other and forgive one another. If any of you has a grievance against someone, forgive as the Lord forgave you. Um, and I really spoke to, I really, uh, when I saw this one, uh, that's the one that really like popped out to me. Um, just because I think it really symbolizes what it's mean to be a good friend and like maintain friendships too, which is very important. Um, and because it's talking about, about forgiving one another, not holding grudges in your friendships, which um, can be very detrimental to friendships if you hold grudges, um, because it can cause more arguments. And um, when you do have arguments, it can get more heated because the grudges might come out. Um, so I think it is very important to forgive each other um, and realize that your friendship means more than whatever silly argument you guys got into. Um, and it also symbolizes how, how the Lord forgave us as, um, when Jesus died on, our, on the cross and forgave our sins, um, so that we may live with him eternally. Um, and as someone that likes to live through God, I think it's important to forgive your friends because, because God forgave us. Um, it's just, um, and so, also what, what, um, when I read this verse and I think what it means for me to be a good friend, um, I think it, it means like supporting them and what they do. Um, like for example, um, I run cross country here at, uh, Valparaiso University. And so a lot of my friends, of course, are on the cross country team. And so, I mean, even if it's a little, just cheering them on during races or workouts and, um, I think that's, that's supporting them too, but also when they're going through a hard time, like, um, maybe, a, a loved one, um, uh, passed away or they're just having family issues or even if they just got a bad grade on a test or something like that, I think it's important to be there for them and, and support them because if I, if that was going to happen to me, like a loved one, uh, passed away or I had a bad test grade or I just had a rough day, I would want them to support me, um, yeah, and so, like I was talking about, not holding grudges, I think is very important. Um, it, um, I think it's very important to, to forgive one another. And also, I think it's also important to give them space if they need it too. Um, so if something happened and they just want, they just need a little bit of alone time for a little bit, I think it's important to respect that and realize that you guys are still friends, of course, but um, they might just need a little time to themselves to figure out some stuff out. But I mean, of course, they're going to come back to you and um, and be there for them when when they need you and um, and if they don't need you at the moment, then you you got to respect that, you know. So yeah, that's why I think it means to be a a good friend, and um, I think it's something that everyone it it takes a little work sometimes because um, sometimes your your own interests can get in the way of, of the friendship, and that's a tough thing to to get past and if you guys get in an argument and you don't you want them to say sorry first and um and but they they want you to say sorry first or something like that i think it's important just to apologize because i bet they feel the same way um and and yeah so hope you we got some from that uh i really did um and so yeah